having a busy mom, working mom, cooking show. Sweetie, so you can help, okay? Okay. okay. So I'm not a very organized person and I tend to not plan ahead very well. I'm kind of a last minute girl. So I usually just try to dig through my refrigerator, see what I have that would make an edible, delectable meal. Um, so today I had Shelby take out some chicken breasts that were frozen. We're going to start with that. We have some taco rice in the microwave with juice from Rotel tomatoes. A little extra. I work at the country club in February, Nebraska. What do you do there? I do maintenance work. You do? Yep. You know, girls do maintenance? Really? Yeah. Wow. Isn't that amazing? It is. I didn't know girls could do maintenance. Well, like, I'm, a tough, I'm a tough girl, so I, I know. know. Yep. On the vine tomatoes, no salmonella. Yeah, I need those. Those are avocados. Thank you. Um, what about onions? Green onions or any kind of onion? Yep. Right. Nope, nope, not that one. I don't want that one. Th those right there on the top. The, green, the one that say green onions. Oh my god, don't show my fridge. Oh my god, no! That's hideous! I'll put those back in the fridge and use those again tomorrow. You might want to get a shot of... I guess he doesn't want to interact with us. <laughs> That's alright. fresh garlic and I really like to use fresh garlic. I don't know that I need this, but just in case. I'm gonna grill the chicken. Yum. Shelby's a chicken fanatic. She loves chicken. Oh, I need it's some good. I need my little droopy. My dripping. What did you say? It's good and good for it you. It is. How smart she is! I take after my mom. Ow! Because I'm so smart. We're kind of old school around here, so we do things the hard way. Uh -huh. Okay, what next? Um, the rice has a little ways to go. Chicken's on. We have to heat these up. We need to rinse these. We need to open these and rinse them. So the can opener's in there. Yep. Yeah, it's kind of technical. Hold on, hold on, hold on. I'll get you started. Oh, I got a little bit of it. Okay, there. For garnish on this masterpiece I'm making, I'm using green onions, tomatoes, and some avocado with sour cream. Um, again, probably not very sanitary. I think we have a high resistance to communicable diseases in this house. I am not a cooking expert at all. I mean, I know just enough to be dangerous. So don't like make fun of me that I don't know what I'm doing with my tools and that sort of thing because I'm just I'm just doing the best I can here. Um, what do you eat for lunch every day? Almost. A turkey sandwich. All right. And didn't you have a nickname once? What did they call you? Turkey sub? Yep. Turkey sub. Because I was so chubby. No, that's not why they called you that. They called you that because you always ordered turkey sub. At, at Subway. I'd like that stricken from the record. This is my very sharp knife. And the very day that I opened this knife package, I was talking to my sister on the phone and she said, Daryl says to um, not cut yourself with the knives. Well, I had already done that and I already had a band-aid on my finger because I tried to put the knife back into its protective case and it slid all the way through and I cut my hand. So what we're gonna do, we're gonna cut up the chicken and mix it together with black beans and the Mexican rice or Spanish rice. 
and we're going to just roll that up into tortillas with some cheese and top it with some sour cream, some onion, tomato, avocado. Kids might not like all that. I just let them do. Okay, so for our next phase, I'm going to use the hotel tomatoes or some of them. These tend to get a little spicy, so I don't use the whole thing. And then we're going to add some black beans. Shelby, would you get uh, I'm probably going to need Well, let's go. Hold on. Let me see. I think that chicken might smell bad. Shelby, do you want to try the first one? Sure. Okay. Now, um, oh. Shelby, do you want like tomatoes or avocado or anything on yours? No. Just rice. Do you want sour cream? Nope. Sure? Yes, I'm sure. Look at all that fiber and protein. Oh yeah. And we've got a little cheese for a little calcium. You don't want any tomatoes or anything like that? You want a little onion? Nope. I'm Just good. like this? Yep. Alright. Why don't you grab a fork? You want a glass of milk? Okay. Just pick it up with your fingers and eat it. Thank you for joining me for Busy Mom's Kitchen. Appreciate your time.